What is up my crazy subscriber? This is Joe Kijal City for today. I'll be teaching you guys how to set up the best class setup for the Ameli Magnifier. Now this gun and this best class setup is one of the most OP class setups I've ever done. Let me tell you guys why. This weapon can actually take out an enemy with five bullets. Five freaking bullets. That's just super insane. I've never done that before except with the Type 95 back in Modern Warfare 3. But I never did a best class setup for that one. But it was as strong as this one. So... Um, five bullets. That's just super insane. And then per mag, you're carrying like around 150 bullets, which is half of the 300 that you're carrying in total. So, with those 150, you can actually take out like around, I don't know, 18 people, 20 people with one magazine. That's just super insane. Never have I ever done this before. Not even with the Stoner of Black Ops 1 before the update or the Hammer of Black Ops 2 before the update. Because I know the Hammer only carried like around, I don't know, 90 or 60 bullets per mag. The Stoner only carried like around 45 or 60. And, you know, it did do a lot of damage, but it wasn't as strong as the Amelie. Never have ever done this before with an LMG. So, I'm telling you guys right now, use the Amelie. It is super effective right now. So let's move on to the attachments. The first attachment I would like to talk about will be the suppressor. Now this attachment can actually be replaceable, but I like to use it because I cannot see with the extended barrel or the regular barrel because the flash is just way too high. So when I'm aiming like super far away, I can't see when it's flashing. So I put the suppressor on. You can you can kind of see because every time you're shooting from long range, there's gonna be smoke coming out from the suppressor. So. I think it's a lot better than the flash so I ended up putting the suppressor on and now I can keep my stealth and I can like sneak around pretty easily around the map with the suppressor and take out a lot of enemies from, from behind so it is a good sneaking weapon and also a good long range weapon even with the suppressor on uh, the next attachment will be the foregrip the foregrip will keep the gun stabilized stabilized sorry and um, I, I uh, suggest to have it at all times because without it, the gun's gonna be all over the goddamn place and you won't be able to take out a lot of enemies from across the map. Let me tell you guys why. If you were to take it off, this gun will only become good for medium range and short range, and that's it. Well, not even for short range, it sucks from short range. So, it will be only usable for medium range. So, do not take away the, take away the foregrip, add it back on, and you should be able to see that the medium range and the long range you'll be the king of it you know from those range because this Amelie is just low one recoil moving on to the next attachment the extended mags now without it I'm thinking you carrying like around 120 bullets per mag with the extended mag now you should be able to carry like half of the bullets that you're carrying in, the, in total because you're in total you're carrying like around 300 and without it you know you pretty much don't have half of what you're totally carrying so Add the extended mags and she's able to carry like 150 out of the 300 they carry in total. So uh, you don't have to worry about reloading maybe like around two minutes inside the game. Two minutes. So, hey, you don't have to press square at all like for the whole time unless you're missing like a lot of times and your accuracy is super low. Then you'll probably see yourself reloading. And also the reload time on this weapon is like around more than 10 seconds. It takes a long time. It takes forever. So you're going to have to like seriously hide behind a box or in the fucking grass to see yourself reloading because it takes forever. So add the extended mag to prevent yourself from reloading and you're going to be just fine. You can be taking like around uh, 20 enemies with one magazine. So... There you have it guys, the attachment, the weapon, is OP, and now the perks. The perks I'm using is low profile, blast suppressor, and hardwired. The reason why I do this because uh, with, the, with the perks is because a lot of people use UAV and um, you know I want to keep myself stra uh, um, you know, stealthy. Uh, perk number three is you know, the blast suppressor. I still don't get it why every time we jump, we appear in the map. That's just super dumb. If you guys didn't want us to use the freaking exosuit, you wouldn't have done that. You know, they gave us like a little ping every time we jump. Uh, the hardwired, I use it because I don't want to get system hacked since it's kind of, kind of being spammed all over the goddamn time. That hit kill streak needs to be higher, man. I can't believe they put it at 600. Uh, the next uh, thing I have, the XO ability, you can have whatever you want. I use the XO overclock. The score streaks, you, can, you guys can have whatever you want, but this is what I'm using right now, and this is what I got uh, during the 86 and 6 gameplay. So that is it, guys. If you guys um, like this best class setup, let me know in the comment section. Leave a like in the video if you guys want to see more best class setups. So that is it. 
Uh, make sure you stick around here in my channel to see for yourself how I do with the Ameli so you guys can imitate what I'm doing because it is a super good gun. So that is it. Subscribe for more. You guys want to see more Call of Duty.